I'll be showing you a really cool Easter egg on how to get this. Woo! Oh, sorry, gliding suit. It is very effective, but you cannot use it from too big of heights. It, uh, it, it, it just will, it will not, you know, it will, you'll crash. I don't want to demonstrate because it does take up a lot of, um, you know, uh, survivalist points. So all you want to do, you want to have, uh, you want Old Town to be unlocked. You'll need Old Town. Sorry if I'm screaming in my mic a little, guys, because there's a lot of loud noises going on upstairs. But you will need Old Town Unlocked. It doesn't matter the percentage of your game. You just need Old Town Unlocked. I have 100% of the game unlocked. So, you know, it doesn't really matter for me because I haven't gotten all the side quests done, but I have gotten uh, the main quest done, which was pretty easy and I got done in not that long. So I will show you where it is on the map. You're gonna wanna go all the way to the left side to this building right here. And you're gonna grapple hook, but in my case, I am gliding because it's a good time to use that. Oh my gosh, some Rice's soldiers. You know what, you guys, I'm not even gonna fight you guys. Ah, oh, I heard something, one of ours? Okay, so you're gonna come over here to this and there's gonna be this little pipe here and a little metal chimney. You're gonna go on top of it and you're gonna, it says World One. It'll ask you to pull it though at first, but since I already did that, you won't need to. It'll bring you to a full level one copy of Mario. So you're gonna go through, you're, you'll see these Goombas, you can't kick them because it says you are in a safe zone. So either just jump around them or just jump over them or something like that. You cannot fall into there. They, people find, call it the uh, blood river because it looks like blood or the zombie river. So what you're gonna wanna do is you're gonna come all the way over here, you're gonna jump past all of this. Uh, most people get it confused for this third pipe, uh, and it's in this area, the hidden block, because in the actual game, there's a hidden block. But it's the second third one, and you're gonna come over here to the, okay, and you're just gonna start jumping rapidly. You're gonna start jumping like crazy till you, till you go onto a visible block. Uh, I'm on top of the invisible block, but right now you don't see anything because I've already got the blueprint, but there will be a blueprint, blueprint, and it will say, it'll say pizza suit. So you're gonna pick that up, You'll all you need is 10 gauze, 10 string, 10 duct tape, and 10 alcohol. For some reason you need alcohol. And then what you're gonna wanna do is, you're, there's a random bomber over there, don't do anything, just let it come to you and blow up. Then you're just gonna, oh! doesn't really matter that much to me because I, uh, you know, but yeah, it just restarts the level. So you cannot, no matter how many times you die, you uh, you don't lose survival points either, so that's good, but no matter how many times you die, you will always respawn the game, so it will not let you out until you beat the entire level. The level is not that long and it is really easy to do. Hidden block is right there. I can't, I can never really memorize the specific block uh, the specific block, but um, I guess that's not the real important thing, though. So you're just gonna, this is, it's normal Mario. So if you ever played the original Mario, it is exactly how it is in the original Mario. You jump up here, jump down, make sure you don't fall into the blood or lava blood, whatever you wanna call it. Now, since that one had guarding, this one doesn't, so you wanna be extra careful on that one. And it, it actually looks a lot harder, like how are you balancing on only that one thing? It isn't actually that hard, so it's not gonna be that big of a deal. You're gonna jump and go onto the pole, you'll slide down it. It has those like firework things, you know? And then you're just gonna jump right onto this tube and then it'll go black and then you'll go back to where you were standing. But now you guys have access to, you know, the pizza suit and so, I, since I've already made it, it doesn't really matter. Uh, I don't need to create it. But you, like I said, you can't jump from too high or you will die. So you might wanna kinda go high and then fall and then onto a car or garbage or whatever you, that softens your landing in general. Then, then it wouldn't be as bad. So yeah, it, it really is neat. It is good for just jumping car to car and jumping over zombies. So you don't. So if there's, if you're like cornered and you have to jump over, over them, you can just easily just float around them and then just run like heck. And 
really that's all I got to say. And some people actually were wondering if if you complete world one, uh, level one, you will go on to level two. No, there's no level two, sadly. There's no level two. It is only, you, you only repeat that one level, which kind of sucks, but it's still really cool. I mean, it's not, not many games have that, do they? they not many games have uh, Mario Easter egg. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Hope you try this, actually, I hope you actually try this out. I find it very effective when you are in sticky situations and it's just fun to glide building the building. Like I can, I can glide pretty far onto this next building and jump. No matter what, if you jump to a building, you will lose a, like one, at least one percentage of health, but it's not that big of a deal. I mean, it's, it's, it's just think of it really guys. It, it's only one piece of health. And med kits aren't really needed with this, so if you do fall and hurt yourself really bad, you can easily just go without having to waste it because you accidentally fell. It, you know, you don't have to go through the whole situation of building more med kits and then having to do that whole situation over again. But that's really all I got. So hope you guys enjoy this video. If you want me to do more tutorials on Dying Light, because you guys ate up that other video pretty fast, and I am very happy that you liked that video because I, I enjoy this game a lot and I hope you guys enjoy watching me play it. The very first Dying Light gameplay video will be coming out soon. So actually sometime today. So just be looking forward for that. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Like, comment, subscribe. I'll see you all later.